Hi, I'm Joe Armstrong, a principal attorney at Offutt Kerman. Today, it's my pleasure to introduce Brian Minichella of the Beacon Group of Companies. Initially, it was just myself in 1996. Uh, we formed Beacon Financial Services. Um, about two years after that, um, we took on another partner, Steve Sharkey, who has um, run and helped co-found Beacon Insurance Services, which is our commercial property and casualty insurance division. Uh, two years after that, we expanded our service offering into the group benefits business with the hiring of Anthony Salucci, who then became a third partner in the Beacon Group of Companies. Well, as my position as the managing partner in the Financial Services Division, Beacon Financial Services, uh, my role and core competence is in corporate retirement plans, the wealth management of the owners and managers of those companies, as well as professional athlete clients. And in positioning ourselves when discussing wealth management issues to these potential clients or potential prospects and current clients, um, we try to separate how we build portfolios to help protect our clients' interests. And what I mean by that is that aside from typical advisory firms um, that use a term that's called asset allocation, which basically means safety through diversification and buying different types of securities, we add an additional level of diversification because we add additional strategies to that typical just buy and hold philosophy. Typically, I think what is also a differentiator um, would be how we choose the investments that comprise those portfolios. Um, fundamentally, we are more on the passive investing side than the active investing side, um, meaning that we shy away from most mutual funds that have active managers. Um, we feel that the additional cost of those funds um, really does not equate to additional value. Um, we are, are more apt to choose passive investments such as ETFs, which are exchange traded funds that have all of the benefits of a mutual fund because of the diversification and the number of securities that are held within that basket of stock, but also have the advantages of a individual stock in that they can trade throughout the course of the day. The utilization of ETFs allows us to build very low cost portfolios and since we don't primarily focus on actively managed funds, we instead actively manage those indexes.